I've come to Russia to confront a river monster, a sturgeon called the Kaluga, that I had no idea existed until now. Testimony to how secretive the local people are with regard to this giant and the fortunes it delivers. It's a living dinosaur on the verge of extinction because poachers are determined to find and kill every last one. But after weeks of searching, I finally have one of these rare beasts in my sights. So this is it, the Kaluga sturgeon of the Amur River. Now, this is big by normal freshwater fish standards, but by the standards of what this fish can potentially grow to, this is a small one. But I've never been so happy and relieved to find a fish alive. These fish grow well over a 1,000 pounds. Big one of these, 15 foot long. I can well believe now the stories of those smashing boats. I'm afraid that the last of the giants may be gone. But as fortunes can still be made from the fish that remain, this story can only end in tragedy for the Kaluga, and sometimes for the fishermen who still hunt them illegally. Despite having heard those stories of uh, deaths and disappearances, the real victim is actually this fish, which we've fished very hard for. Well, this is the biggest one that I've seen. Um, this thing's been hunted really to the edge of extinction, all for the sake of its valuable eggs. That's really very sad. And uh, I really hope that this population comes back. But even in the face of this human onslaught, nature has a surprising ability to cling on. As this rare living dinosaur returns to the deep, I find something in the boat that gives me a glimmer of hope. It's quite something when I think that uh, I've heard so much about this fish, particularly in terms of the very large size that it can reach, over a thousand pounds, 15, 16 foot long, and to think that when I put this back over the course of many years, it could grow big enough to drag people out of boats. But uh, here it is, a perfect, oh, perfect miniature Kaluga.